Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. My name is Hania and I'm going to be describing our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. I saw a man with striking appearance, be uh, radiant face, beautifully created, and his belly was in protruding. And nor was his head disproportionate and small, proportionate and delicate, finely made and um, specimen of a creation. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, in his eyes there was a contrast. The dark was immensely dark and the white was excessively uh, white and his eyelashes were long and his neck was elegantly long and his beard was full and thick and when the and his when his friends came and they were with him they used to um, join him and then surround him and then try to serve and protect him and when he was silent dignity covered him and when he spoke it was audible and clear almost like commanding and overtaking and there his eyebrows were arced but they're not they weren't joined they were separated and when you can see him from afar he was the most striking and outstanding in appearance and when he came near they were the best of them and the most handsome of them in closeness such a sweet level of logic when he used to speak it was coherent and easy to understand his logic his utterances his words were like a were like jewels coming out of a necklace calculated polished flowing magically one after another he was in he was in medium in height your eyes didn't have to strain to look up at him or it was tedious to look down at him he was medium a comfortable sight to look at and and when he used to say something, they used to hearken what he said. And when he gave a command, they used to compete to fulfill the command. And when um, his friends, his um, sahabas used to sit at his feet, the two conflicting feelings came in their heart. First feeling that they wanted to look up at him, this beautiful, handsome face. But the second one was that they get the shyness covered them and then they just they look up and then the shyness covered and then they look down. And the, there is this one time was Anas Ibn Malik said um, in the desert there was a full moon day and he got up and he saw the beautiful full moon. It was a very amazing and hence it was clear it was it was just clear, it was beautiful, it was handsome. And he, he had a thought. He was, let me see if the moon is more handsome or my prophet is more handsome. Then he went, he could see the prophet from afar. He was he was clear, he, you, you can see him glow, you can see him from the far. And then he looked at the moon, he, he looked at the prophet's face, he looked at the moon. He looked at the prophet's face, he looked at the moon. He looked at the prophet's face, he looked at the moon, and he said, Wallahi, the prophet is more beautiful than the moon. And um, uh, Hazrat Aisha, Hazrat Aisha, Razi ta'ala anha, said one time she was sewing, and with a needle, and the needle dropped in the dark. She said, Ya Rasul, I can't find my needle. It dropped in the dark. Ya Rasul came closer, and from the radiance, from the glow from his face, um, she said, I swear, from the radiance from his face, I found my needle. Amr ibn al, Amr ibn al, uh, Amr ibn al As said, um, if you tell me to, dis 
I've sit, I'm, I have been, I've been sitting with my Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam all of the time. I've seen him a lot of time. 